This is Troy, man. He actually designed the GoPro swivel mount, so he's gonna explain it to you guys because I wanna end up getting one, just because it, it really does. It allows you to capture some nutty shit. Oh yeah. So, so this is the swivel mount here. When you buy a swivel mount, it comes in a box. It doesn't come with a GoPro, sorry. Um, it comes with a box, but we put spots so you can have your GoPro in there. So it's kind of a complete carrying solution. You close the whole thing, carry your GoPros around with your swivel mount. The way it works, take the, the magnetic base out. The base has three magnets in it. This is our high speed version. Um, it's really sturdy. I mean, I'm shaking the whole car here. Right? So you got two tabs you pull them off with. But the swivel mount goes on here. Put a screw in there. Find yourself a nice pink screwdriver. And you know, this doesn't have to just be for drifting. Like really, if you want to capture footage of any car, you know what I mean? Like if you're just, if, if you're not at a drift event or somebody's not letting you in their car or something, you think it's cool, like you can just put it on your car going down the road, you know what I mean? Yeah. And get some like footage yeah. just this, driving behind you. This is this is a great solution for drivers and media. Right, you know? yeah. Because uh, we have we have a lot of media guys that, that run these mounts and they'll just run around and throw them on cars and whatever doing that today you'll see some footage right. of that. But uh, that's that's a really good thing for. So this snaps onto the car now. Duct tape, don't forget that. The duct tape, the duct tape won't scratch your car. The duct tape isn't important because it doesn't scratch your car with or without it, but some oh. people are um, yeah, picky. concerned, right? Concerned well, about Well, if you got cars. a Lambo, it's pretty explainable. Yeah, yeah. So th this is just kind of like a pro tip, throw some duct tape on the bottom and you'd be totally fine. Um, or cars that are not painted well. So this car is half spray painted, half uh, painted with a spray gun. So the, the paint isn't very durable. Um, oh, yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. there, there's like chips here just from throwing tools in the car. Um, so that's what the duct tape's for. The duct tape really isn't necessary. It'll work over like wraps and stuff. Yeah, oh yeah. So that goes on the car and the way it works is as the car is, is pivoting and turning with your, with your drift, the, the flag on the back is catching the wind and it's turning the camera back and forth. So when you're sliding that way, the camera's pointed that way. When you transition and slide the other way, the camera points the other way. That's the basic concept of how that works. So this is, this is our high speed uh, swivel mount. This oh, so there's for, different ones? Yeah, so this sells for 175 Another option is you can just buy a dual bag mount. So this is a $35 mount. You can put your GoPro right on it. So, Turbo. Show that off, boy. Some noises out there. <laughs> uh, so, so this mount has the same three-prong design as any other uh, GoPro mount. This can go anywhere. Put it on, on the roof. You can put it on the side of the car. Uh, I, I put it on the well. I put it on the cage. I put it in the wheel well. I put it uh, on the window frame. So just get really good in-car shots. You can oh shit! No way. So I'll put it in here. Oh fuck! That's even better because I do it in my car all the time. There you go. So you can get a bunch of different angles. You can put it on the roof over here if you want. Right. I mean, my roof, my roof metal is probably a fabric on here. Yeah, but no, see, I have like one of those window stickers. Yeah, the, you know? yeah, the suction cups. Yeah. Oh man, we don't. <laughs> we we specifically didn't choose suction cups because we don't want somebody's three four hundred dollar GoPro rolling down the track. Right. Yeah. yeah it falls you, off all you know, the time. I mean, you got a nice GoPro here. You know what? Right. Like. Yeah. So you wouldn't want to risk your equipment. And I don't want to risk your equipment either. Right. Which is why we use these really strong magnets. Right. So, and you know, like it's. The thing is, guys, is like a lot of the times, like when I'm trying to get those like nice transitions in cinematics, like this does that for you. It's just a smooth turn to whatever you're turning. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's yeah. so we it's hard. It's hard. It's so hard to fucking stay stable. Hey, yeah, we have a lot of uh, different footage out there. So if you follow our, our, our Instagram channel, right, just swivel underscore mount. Um, there's footage of of the swivel mount being on the hood of the car. It's really cool because it, it looks like a chase cam that, that's following yeah, the car standing. Yeah, pretty much. Um, we have this guy in our wheel well, so you can see the front tire moving back and forth. You can see the suspension going up and down, like that kind of stuff. So it's really cool. You can get really creative. This 
You can put on anything. It's not just a car thing. Anything metal? Anything metal. If you're big into, um, uh, if you're doing like construction, you throw this on the side of your, your, your bucket or whatever, your excavator, anything like that. Your helmet? It, your helmet. You got a helmet, you got a, metal you got helmet. got a metal helmet. Put it on one of the screws on your drift helmet, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it might work. You'll have to put a couple screws on. Um, but, but this can be used for just about anything that's metal. It doesn't have to be in a car. Just pretty cool. So people that are living in the city, you want to get those dope shots, your car rolling through town, yeah. on bags, all. Yeah. Psst. Throw it on one of the stairs going up to a car building. There you go. But yeah, that's that man. We have a ton of different flag options. We got red, we got this carbon fiber look. Oh, what is that? How big is it? So it's the, the flag on top. This one here is, is an old version, right? Yeah, the link will be down in the description.